Yo, what is up everyone and welcome to your brand new tutorial on my YouTube channel. This video will be explaining how to fix your controller issue that appears just right on the screen. Uh, a lot of people have been facing this issue and so did I and it was pretty hard to find a tutorial on it so I decided to make one myself and help everyone out. So if you have this issue be sure to follow every single step and we'll be able to sort it out and get you going. Alright so the first thing we want to do is go over to the first link in the description and open that up. The link contains a Google Drive with a lot of files in it that you're going to need for your controller to work on FIFA 20. Alright so what you're going to be doing is you're going to select every single file in that folder by just dragging along and you're going to press right click, you're going to press download and wait for the download to finish. As soon as the download finishes it should appear on the bottom left of your Chrome just as it's doing now and you're just going to wait till it's completely done. Alright, so the first thing I'm going to do is go to my desktop and make a new folder called files just to throw them in there so we don't directly have to extract them to the FIFA 20 folder. So what you're going to do is you're going to press the extract to button, find the folder you assigned it to and press extract. As soon as that's done, you're going to go to your FIFA 20 folder. I created a shortcut on my desktop, but you guys know where to find it. All you're going to do is open up the folder that you just downloaded, select every single file and just drag it into your FIFA 20 folder. You're going to see the programs on the bottom probably and you're all you're going to want to do is just open that up real quick. Alright, from this point make sure your controller is plugged in and as soon as you hear that little windows beep it should be able to work. As you can see the thumbsticks on the screen right now and the D buttons that I'm pressing, everything's working as usual. I'm using a PS4 controller as well so you don't have to worry about your controller not being being able to work. Um, it just shows an Xbox controller but it works with every every single controller out there. Alright so the next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna go to game settings and you're gonna want to press uh, the green plus button add. You're gonna look for your FIFA 20 um, launcher. Alright, so what you're going to do next is you're going to press FIFA 20 and open it up. You're going to wait for it to appear in the little list and please make sure to select the little square box in front of the FIFA 20. Also what you're going to want to do is select every single 64 bit on the right side and the bottom one and next up just press apply. It shows everything is okay and all you're going to have to do is press OK. Alright, so the last step is you're gonna check your controller again, make sure everything works and if it doesn't, please be sure to change your USB port or try and use a different cable because everything should be able to work. Just minus the program down, don't close it down, just minus it down. Open up your FIFA 20. Uh, if you didn't change your FPS settings yet or your quality or resolution, please be sure to change that and make sure the game's in full screen. So the next thing is you're gonna you're gonna want to open your FIFA 20 and everything should be able to work. All right, as you can see, we're in the main menu and we can scroll through every little option without spazzing around and going up and down. Uh, just to show you guys, I'm gonna hop in the practice arena and show you that I can do everything I want to. All right, as you can see, I can shoot, I can move wherever I want to go. Let's give it another try. Yep can move left and right, doesn't do any weird stuff, I can shoot whenever I want and it should, everything should be able to work now. If you guys have any questions or want me to make any more tutorials about anything, please be sure to comment down below on what you need and what you uh, may be looking for, solutions, tutorial, tips and tricks, whatever you guys want. I'll be releasing another video to change your commentating language because a lot of people are stuck on a, a specific language and don't know how to change. I'm horrible at this game by the way. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope this tutorial was useful. Um, leave a like. Subscribing is always appreciated. And uh, yeah, peace out. See you guys later.